section. Hello, it is me. Stick my face in there. And this is Ben Robinson. Okay. So, um, as you can see, the nut is here. So this is the first rat. I'm going to be... I haven't learned this yet, but I'm going to be demonstrating um, Wake Me Up When September Ends um, by Green Day off their album American Idiot, which was not something that I listened to at the time of its release. I do like Green Day a lot. Um, <laughs> that was Melissa and the views reflected by my girlfriend who I love very much do not necessarily represent the views of the broadcaster uh, but no they, no Green Days I don't think they sold out I think they just changed but um, so here we go so the starting position and uh, there's a stroke style it's like uh, one, one, two, up, it's like down, 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 up, I'm not going to get all fancy, or down, down, up, okay, I don't know, I'm not going to get fancy with the proper stroking, no reaction, <laughs> apparently this is just normal for me to say around Melissa, uh, <laughs> Sorry. So we're only really playing two um, strings here. And what we're playing is on the sixth uh, fret, we're, we're making a G shape. So this would be G major, this would also be G major, but so pushing down on the third I think is what makes it a G. Um, the third on the sixth string, third fret on the sixth string, and then on the fifth string we're pushing down on the fifth fret. <coughs> and then because I assume that people like myself are sloppy guitar players. We're muted the fourth string. Um, we're muting the fourth string. So when we play it, it it do, it doesn't ring out. So there we go. So on the sixth, you put your your. It, uh, my teacher calls it my second finger, which is what we would call my middle finger. And the pinky is called the fourth finger. And the index is called the first. Anyways, so. And then we move up to the second fret on the second string. Um, sorry, on the second fret on the sixth string, and keep the pinky on the fifth fret. Like I said, I don't have this down all nice and smooth, so. And then, so that would be G, F sharp, and then we go to, this is Wake Me Up When September Ends by Green Day. Uh, and then we go to an E minor. And since this is a, only two chords are being played, uh, we just push, the, the sixth string is open. Open like that, nothing's pressed down. And we use our third finger, which would be our ring finger, on the fifth fret, and again muting the fourth string. So open six, uh, second, fifth, and it's... 
And then with once we get that down, we can kind of get a feel for how the saga is going, or I do. But I, I, I paid, I paid money to buy the song, um, and uh, so the guitar version that I'm learning does not sound like the song. Um, there's all these drums and extra effects, and that that's what makes produced music great, but this is just so. Next, we're going to the 10th fret on the 6th string and the 12th fret on the 5th string, and this is a D chord. So if you look at the guitar here, you got dot, 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 and the double dot, double dot, almost always with most guitars is your 12th fret. So. Since we used the ring finger or the third finger on the uh, second fret on the fifth string to get that sound, we can slide all the way down to the twelfth because we want to do this fast and fluid. So we go and then twelve and ten. And then we just slide it to, I think it's up, but my teacher calls it down. We slide it towards the nut um, because I'll, they're trying to get my lucky charms. And uh, that would be a C chord. And then. Um, we go al the we kind of have to we've had our fingers in the uh, the 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 third finger on the fifth string all the time so far, but for this next part we uh, switch it to. Um, the 6th string 11th fret, so that would be here, and the 5th string 10th fret, so it would look like that. And again, muting the 4th. So that's kind of like a reverse of how the power chord was structured before. And then we go back to the beginning, which we should know well by now, which is, if, if you've been practicing this a few times, you should know this well by now, which is uh, the G shape, which is the sixth string, third fret, uh, fifth string, fifth fifth fret. Yeah. So I'm going to play that out for you. And this is just the first v verse or chorus or whatever. Um, so it goes. the lyrics at all but so but picture Green Day singing they're kind of like na, 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 na. That's how you do it. <laughs> 